to Creative Glam. If you're new here, my name is Sharon. If you're returning, thanks and welcome back. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button below along with the notification bell. Hit that notification bell twice so you'll be notified when I upload new videos and I upload new videos twice a week. Today on Creative Glam, I'm participating in the Fall Tag 2018. This tag was created by Home Decorating with Liz. Liz created this tag a couple weeks ago. It's an open invite to anyone who's interested in participating. I will leave a link to Liz's channel below in the description box. Now this tag has 15 fall related questions, which I thought was lots of fun. I will leave all 15 questions down below in the description box as well. Question number one is, question number one is what is your favorite fall color? Well, I don't know if they're necessarily fall colors, but my favorite colors right now are sage green and navy blue. So I would say those are my favorite fall colors because they're my favorite colors. Question number two is, what is your favorite fall pumpkin color? I would say cream. I love the cream colored pumpkins because they go with everything. You can put them everywhere and anywhere and they don't clash. They go with every decor theme that you could possibly think of. So cream colored pumpkins are my favorite. Question number three is, are you a fall or winter person or both? I would choose fall over winter any day. I'm a spring girl. I prefer the spring and summer and fall in that order. You could completely get rid of winter and I'd be okay with that. I am, I'm from the Southwest, so summer is my zhuzh. That's what I do. Uh, winter is not my thing. Winter is something that I am supposed to visit and then leave and go home. But I currently live in the Northwest, I mean the Northeast now and uh, I don't like snow. I don't like living and experiencing daily snow and ice. Not my thing. So I would choose fall over winter any day. Let's see, number four is, if you could receive one gift card, what store would you shop at and why? Hmm. I guess it would depend on the amount of the gift card. I would choose William and Sonoma's uh, because I love that store and because I need some new pots and pans. So William and Sonoma is the store that I would choose, but it really does depend on the amount of the gift card because it could end up being um, home goods. So it just, it depends on the amount of the gift card. But I'm gonna say William and Sonoma's because I need new pots and pans. <laughs> okay, question number five. Do you like going to the pumpkin patch? I used to. When my children were smaller, that was a family, uh, that was a family outing that I always looked forward to. The children loved going to the pumpkin patch, all the pumpkins and the hot chocolate. It was loads of fun. We had a great time. Um, but now, would I go to the pumpkin patch? Probably not. Um, I don't really use live pumpkins anymore. I don't usually decorate with live pumpkins. I usually use the faux pumpkins that I can take and put into storage and put away and bring back out annually. But if I wanted a live pumpkin, I'd probably get one from my grocery store. But would I go to the pumpkin patch? Is What was the question? Did I like going? I liked going when my children were small, but not now. What is your favorite fall animal? Huh. My favorite fall, I didn't know there was a fall animal. <laughs> Liz, I, my favorite fall animal? Um, mm, I, I don't know, I don't know. I don't have a favorite fall animal. My puppy, my dog, Major, is my favorite fall animal because he's my favorite animal, but I just don't know. I mean, you think of squirrels, but I don't like squirrels. Squirrels scare me. Um, I don't mind looking at them from a distance, but squirrels scare me. Um, I don't know if, I don't know. So I, I, I'm gonna say my puppy, Major. <laughs> He's my favorite fall animal. He's my favorite animal. That's my final answer, my puppy. Let's see, number seven. How do you like to warm up when it's cold outside? Blankets, blankets, and more blankets. I love blankets, 
the bigger, the fluffier, the softer, the better. Blankets. Blankets and tea. That's my thing. That's how I like to warm up. Do you celebrate Halloween? Why or why not? No, I do not celebrate Halloween. Um, it's not my thing. Um, I did when I was younger, when I was a child, I celebrated Halloween. But after I became an adult and had children, um, no, I don't celebrate Halloween. And I'll leave it at that. What color or colors will you be using to decorate with? Oh, the same colors that I've been using, and I know you guys are probably sick of hearing me say it, navy blue, sage green, cream, tan, and like an aquamarine-ish kind of colors. That's the color thing that I have going throughout my home. So those are the colors in which I'll be decorating with this fall and um, winter as well. I'll be carrying it through the rest of this year. Let's see, question number 10. Did you get married in the fall? If so, which month? No, I did not get married in the fall. I got married in the summer. Summer is my thing. Question number 11, do you have a birthday coming up during the fall? If so, what is your birthday? If not, do you have a husband or wife or children born in the fall? What is their birthday? No, I don't. I don't have a birthday in the fall. Um, my husband's not born in the fall. My children were not born in the fall. Everyone was born in the summer. <laughs> so as you can see, spring and spring and summer, all, all of us were born in the spring or summer. But I guess that's how you make spring and fall makes spring and summer babies. What does fall mean to you? Oh, and I think that's one of the things that's so wonderful about fall. It evokes a feeling of family, togetherness, uh, the beginning of the holiday season, uh, the weather changes. You get to change your outfits and your clothes and you get to kind of cover up a little more. I love a big cable knit sweater with boots. I just love the fashion. Number 13, what is your favorite food to cook for your family during the fall season? Chili. Uh, my three bean chili is famous. It's very good. But I like the fact that, you know, you not only do the, the does the season change and the clothing change, but the food changes. It gets heartier. And, you know, I've got a three bean chili that I enjoy cooking. But I also like doing pot roast and potatoes and macaroni and cheese and um, it's, the food is denser and it's heavier and it's cozier. So all that cozy comfort food, I love it. But my favorite would be my three bean, my famous three bean chili. Do you plan to travel this fall? If so, to where? Yes, we are going to take a trip in December. We usually take an annual trip in December. I don't quite know where we're going at this time. Um, I'd like to go to Turks and Caicos but I don't know if that's going to be the final destination or not. We're still working that out. But yes, we will be traveling um, and I'm just not exactly sure where, but it will be a warm climate because again, I live in the Northeast. So I will, be, I will be running from the cold looking for someplace warm. Number 15 is pumpkin spice latte, pumpkin smoothie, pumpkin spice coffee, spicy autumn punch or a hot apple cider tea i'm gonna say pumpkin spice latte because as you know i love lattes and i had my first believe it or not i had my first pumpkin spice latte um last weekend my my daughter and i had a mother daughter day and uh before we went shopping we stopped at starbucks and got some coffee and i had a starbucks pumpkin spice latte and it was very good, I enjoyed it. I know it gets a bad rap, but I enjoyed it. Um, my, my drink though for fall and winter is my eggnog lattes. I usually do eggnog lattes. And the pumpkin spice wasn't far off, it just had a little more of that nutmeggy kind of taste to it, and I loved it. I thought it was pretty good. Um, I'll get another one, or I'll make them at home. Yeah, that's it. That was lots of fun. I figured it was an opportunity for you to get to know a little bit about me and for me to share a little bit about how I feel about fall. I love it, but it's still my number three season. <laughs> Again, this is an open invite tag and everyone is welcome to participate. 
Uh, it was created, the, the fall tag 2018 was created by Liz of Home Decorating with Liz. Her link is down below in the description box along with 15 questions. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed my fall tag 2018. And if you did, hit that subscribe button below along with the notification bell. Hit that notification bell twice so you'll be notified when I upload new videos and I upload new videos twice a week. Thanks for watching. Enjoy the rest of your day. I'll see you right back here next time. Bye.